welcome back to my channel and if you're new my name is Super Melbert and you should definitely hit that subscribe button to see more content just like this you can also follow me on Twitch which is right here and my Instagram is right there and I will also link them in the description below so be sure to follow me there alright so for this tutorial I'm going to be teaching you guys how to plug or connect your PlayStation 4 controller onto your PC and I'm going to show you two ways alright so the first way is to just plug it in with the cable uh, just plug it in the same way you would plug it onto the PS4 so so plug one end here and plug the other end onto your computer and that's it it should be ready to use you don't have to do anything else but um, if you do this you might notice that you're not hearing any sound and if that's the case for you all you gotta do is click right here at the bottom right with the sound, the sound icon and click over here it says uh, headset earphone wireless controller or whatever it says here just click this and try all of these right now it's set to this but try all of these until you get the right one in my case it's this and just try all of them and try to adjust the volume and clearly clearly you can hear a sound so in my case it's it's this one right here so if you're having trouble uh, if you're not hearing any sound just, just do that all right now the other way is to connect it wirelessly all right so what you're gonna want to do is you're gonna want to press and hold the share button and the home button at the same time all right so press it press and hold it at the same time just like this and it should start blinking and you, I don't think you can see it on camera right now so let me turn off my light real quick uh, right there it's hard to see but it's blinking so when that happens uh, just type uh, go here to search and type Bluetooth and it should just be right here press that and make sure the Bluetooth is on so if it's off make sure to turn it on all right and what you're gonna want to do is click up up here where it says add Bluetooth or other device and click Bluetooth and you should uh, see the wireless controller and just click that and that's it you're ready to go just press done and you're ready to it's just it's ready to go you don't have to do anything else all right so let's uh let me show you some uh, gameplay on uh let's play some rocket league all right so as you can see i'm using the controller right now so let's just uh quickly play something something casual and I'm not very good at this game so I'm just gonna let you know now all right here we go guys oh yeah let's go Oh man, I can't even get the ball. Ooh, yes. Man, the guy beat me to it. Ooh, I missed that, man. How did I miss that? Yes. Oh. Thought that was going to go in. No. Yes. Good job, teammate. Good job. Yes, yes. We got this. Let's go. Let's go. There you go. All right, guys. Now, if you want to disconnect your controller wirelessly, uh, go back to the search bar over here and type Bluetooth. 
and open this up and right here you're gonna see wireless controller click that and remove device click yes and that's it that's all that you have to do and there you guys have it it's as easy as that that's all you have to do to connect your PlayStation 4 controller onto your PC and guys I hope this video was helpful and if it was be sure to hit that subscribe button give this video a like comment down below do all that good stuff don't forget to follow me on Twitch which is right here and Instagram up there they'll also be linked in the description below and that's it for this video I'll see you guys next time later